Hello and thanks again for joining me for another episode of Escape the Pacific. So in our last episode we checked out this other little island over here. Uh, found ourselves another barrel so we're going to tie that down. Pop that under our bed as well. And uh, other than water, there's a lot of stuff we can put in barrels. So we can fill it up with salt. We can fill it up with oil. Uh, we can put compost in it. Quite a few things that we can use it for. And water is probably the least useful because it doesn't stay good in the barrel. And I'm not sure if we'll take this little chest. Maybe we will. We'll, uh... We've got that shipwreck over there. It's a bit too dark to go diving for that. We won't be able to see anything under the water. So we're going to have a sleep until sunrise. And we are now... Six days. Uh, didn't click over into the seventh day. Thought it would have, but uh, apparently not. Alright, we've got our coconuts there. So, alright, we're going to pop that in a bag. Drop that, drop that, drop that. Now, I mean the sun's over there, so it's still a bit dark and murky here. But, uh... It's not a very deep wreck. Looks like a pretty small one. Probably not going to find much on here. There would usually always be at least one crate. Chest. It's still pretty dark. There's a crate there. I don't see much else. But these little tiny ones, usually they'll sometimes only have the one. You get a bit deeper and a bit bigger. You find two usually. And every now and then you'll find a big one that might have three on it. The third one will usually be like a little tiny chest. Which is not very useful. So, grab our gear. Have a look what we've got. Another axe. A couple of things, so. Alright. We will drop that down here for the moment. Uh, I'm going to pick my raft up. And I'm just going to spin it around a bit. Drag it up so it's not bumping up and down so much. It's still rocking a little bit. Alright, so we've got some coconuts. Let me get these bushes out of the way here so I can see what I'm doing. Okay, so we've got some coconuts over there, we haven't got any left, I think we've got one or two, we've got plenty of stripped ones, but we are running out of ropes and we've got a lot more stuff to tie down on here yet, going to need small ropes for our windows and doors later on, so we're going to make ourselves a coconut holder, this one. I don't recommend using these on land because putting uh, putting your coconuts in them and taking them out is rather slow compared to just having them stored on the ground. So I think we need yeah one small stick, 
five fire sticks. But for transporting coconuts, we'll uh, use one of these. So, pick that up and put it over here. Tie that down. Doesn't like that position, so we just give it a slight adjustment. Let's try that. There we go. All right, so I'll grab these. Pop them in. See, like you put one in, takes a while. You have to wait for the for the animation before you can put another one. And it's the same with getting them out as well. So, all right, we'll just have a quick look, see if any more dropped overnight. here uh, there was a tent we already picked up the land from there I think okay so this one we're just gonna shove on here I'll put it on the edge so it kind of falls onto its side. And we're going to nestle it up against there. Tie that down. Uh, crab wants to take the little chest. I don't know if we'll bother taking the little chest. It's not really worth it okay so pop me ropes away I've only got two so oh, we can make another one there let's uh let's have a look around us that oil in there looks pretty close that's a e. That looks pretty close, so I reckon we'll uh, we'll head on over to there. Pretty much almost pointed in the right direction anyway. So we'll just pop her out in the water. Jump on. And sail across. Make sure we've got enough clearance to get past that wreck there. You're gonna hold down E, press U to speed up time. Uh, this one's pretty close, so I'm not gonna pause the uh, recording on the trip with this one. We'll, won't take us too long to get there, I don't think. So, hopefully, we're looking for some of them crates that we break down into planks so we can finish building off our cabin. Uh, we could do with a couple more barrels and anything else we can find. So, we'll continue exploring a few of these islands, see what we can find.
and then once we've got all this built up then we'll probably go and try and find the next cluster do you see a shipwreck there you can see the mast sticking out of the water over there Still haven't had any rain. And that tends to be a bit random. Sometimes you get rain on your first day, sometimes you get storms. Uh, there are seasons, I believe, but uh, didn't really mess with any of the settings of that. Do see what looks to be a crate or two over there. That looks like a bit of a deeper shipwreck there. Alright, so we'll stop the fast travel and we'll just cruise on in. Do see some coconuts just there. Bring our sails down. Pop off. Pick these up. Grab those before they float away. Chuck them straight in here. Let's, uh, some more turtle, turtle eggs there. Not going to worry about them at this stage. Okay. Yep, so that's a chest that we can break down. There's three of them here, so that's pretty cool. Alrighty, we'll uh, go have a look at what else is there. That's a big turtle. Don't have access to bird meat. Then uh, I'll kind of pick up that coconut there. Don't have access to, uh, to bird meat. Oh, we've got a chest here. Crate. Then uh, those big turtles, the adult ones, will give you, should give you four meat. Got some goodies in there. Muddy water, we don't want that. Pour that out. Oil. these in not sure exactly how many coconuts you can fit in these more turtle eggs there grab all these coconuts that are on the, along the shoreline got some mangroves here so Got our jar handy. I typically always keep an empty jar or a bottle on me. Alright, got more coconuts here. I might be able to carry all these in one trip. So when you're picking them up with E into your hand, it'll drop one to pick up the next one if you can't fit it in your hand or in your bags. So there's still a few to pick up around here. Pop 
pop them in. See, it's rather slow putting them in here. So, unless you do want to take them on your raft, better off just uh, making a little corral or something to keep them on, on land. Got more here as well. Okay, so continue around here, pick up the rest. Coconuts always, always come in handy. Still going to need a lot of rope to uh, finish off our to finish off our raft and to tie down other things that we find. Now here we've got nests, eggs. As soon as you pick up that egg, all those seagulls are going to attack you, and they can damage you pretty bad. So. I'm going to leave them alone for now. Now that coconut there is a bit glitched. It won't let me pick it up. So you can, uh, you can cook things with eggs. Certain recipes and that that use them. Not going to worry about it at this stage. It's not really worth it in my opinion. Okay, so another one there, pop that in, alrighty, uh, we've got shipwreck, where is it, over there, so we'll Pop all our stuff in our bag and drop our bags. Go for a swim. So what we find on this one. This one's a bit further out, a bit deeper. So if we just bob up on the top. You see our air, our oxygen will sort of go up while we're bobbing up and down and we can get a good look at what we can see. I see a crate there. So those ones there you can't pick up. Sometimes you'll find something up on this deck. Okay, there's a chest there, so we'll grab that. I think there's only going to be the two on this one. So we'll take this chest back and then we'll come back and get that other crate. Pretty soon. It's leveled up our swimming. Yeah, that other crate was down here in the middle. Take this back. Don't forget, don't pick these up with E when you're underwater. That'll most likely weigh you down. 
end up having to drop it and then they can be very hard to find again. Alright, so uh, we picked up this one as well. Let's have a look. Okay, so we've got a few things. Lanterns. More lanterns. Some oil. Okay, so I will drop these lanterns. And they all land on top of each other in a row. I'm going to put the oil in them. And now we've got ourselves another spare empty bottle. So pop the oil back in there. With the bottle rubber and we'll put the lanterns in there. I just leave keep a, a little jar or a bottle on me at all times. But uh we'll just use up this salt here. Okay. So that one has only got a tiny bit of oil in it. Let's pull these out. Actually, we'll take all of this stuff. Uh, seal jar. We'll take all of this stuff and all of this stuff. And we'll pop that in this crate back here. and spare sealed jar put them up here okay so now we're going to break these down Got a bunch more planks so what we can do now is we can build some more walls on our cabin but uh, that's going to do it for this episode if you did enjoy this episode please leave me a like or a comment down below if you want to see more please hit the subscribe button thank you very much for watching i'll see you in the next video